it do YouTube it's your boy ill will getting back at y'all real quick with a pro tools tips and tricks video um I actually had about four or five emails asking me if I was actually getting delay using the pre presets on the new nectar plugin from azotope which I am if you can look right down here you see that I'm getting the delay of 121 samples um I did a little Google research and really didn't come up with much. So I actually come in here and play with the plugin just a little bit and I actually found a quick fix for you guys. So um, just, you know, follow, follow along real quick and I'll actually show you how to fix this. Um, open up the plugin and come over here to advanced view. Click on advanced view. Now come down here to options open up options, come up to delay compensation, click on it. Now you want to unenable it. Hit close, your delay goes away. I'm super fresh, hate indeed is fine by me. Suit yourself to face me at this suicide. You may want All right, pretty simple. Um, you see the, the delay just actually come back when I took the uh, limit latency off. Um, you also want to check that and it'll keep it at zero. All right. So, um, those two little tricks hit. Okay. You're ready to go, go and do your thing. Um, this will get rid of your delay for you. Uh, for all of you out there that don't know how to tell how much delay you actually have on a track, it's really easy in pro tools. All you do is you come down here to the bottom where you see your volume, hold down command or what would it be control on a PC click twice and your delay will show up. It'll show you what your delay is. All right. Um, if y'all have any more questions on this, um, y'all know what to do. Just comment below PM me or leave it on the forum. That's, um, www.fatassmixes.com forward slash form. Um, if there's anything else y'all need to know about this plugin, please just hit me up, leave comments, let me know what's going on and definitely like these videos, alright? It's your boy Ill Will. I'll holla at you.